I just got choked up on something. How's everyone doing today? Yeah, we're good there. And here. Thank you for joining me today. We are playing Pokemon Yellow in my self-imposed Gotta Catch Em All challenge. Thank you for joining me today. We Oop. are playing... There we go. Let me not... Let me at least mute that. Where are we? Right. Wrong, 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 wrong. Mute that. There we go. And that should be active. Okay. I think we're good. There we go. Gotta make sure I have mute pages more often. Let's keep going. Oh, wait. Yeah, we're going backwards, aren't we? Yes, we are. Okay. But yeah. Hey, Kells, what's going on? How you doing, bud? Come on, yellow. Let's bring it on. More battles. Sabrina. Okay. Ah, why is my hair in the way? There we ah! There we go. Now my hair is out of my face. Sorry about that. Had to just get it brushed back enough so my headset holds it down. Wing attack, yes. Come on, Pidgeotto. Never mind. You got nothing. I don't want to swap to Pikachu yet, do I? Fly. Let's at least try to avoid some damage. Oh, your defense goes up. Does Fly... Fly does not do nearly enough damage. Mm, Pikachu, go. 45... Yeah, you withdrew. That's perfectly fine. Thunderbolt. No, nah, that's fine, dude. Kells, I, I was using an unpowered... Like, I, today I finally spent some points on it just to get the HP up a little bit, and then key and stamina up, but... Like, he had base attack for a level 80 and base damage overall, and I was able to fight you. I'm surprised at myself that I... Like, I'm surprised at myself for how well I played that. Even with Goku Black Rose, I kind of nearly stepped on you a little bit. So... I don't blame you for doing that, and it was fun. And you warned me, so that's cool. There we go. Pokemon. Channeler sent out a Ghastly. Pidgeot. Uh, not that. Wing attack, sh yeah. Wing attack hits ghosts. If it yeah, this will work perfectly. <laughs> Almost. Alright, Pidgeot, you're out. Pikachu. Go. Thunderbolt. Good job, Pikachu. Everyone's slowly growing. Pikachu again, yeah. Thunderbolt. In this instance, I probably don't need to be using... I should probably... I should just lead with Pikachu for the rest of this gym. There's nothing else can really handle the damage output. That the ghosts in here can have, and same with the psychics. Because he doesn't have a phone. Red does not call the police on Team Rocket because he doesn't have a phone. Remember, this is back in 1990... Or, shoot. Back in 1980... 
89 when the first Pokemon came out? I feel like I'm wrong there. Like, it was 1990s when everyone was playing it. Definitely. Blah, blah, blah. Blah, 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 blah. Yeah, it was the 90s when everyone was playing it, but the first version came out in Japan either 89 or 86, I feel like. So, you know, cell phones weren't really a thing. And there's, surprisingly, there's no telephone boxes on the street. Thanks for the host, Kells. You choose swap up here. Uh, item bicycle. Go. Let's get rolling. Pum pum na na. Bo do do do. Ah. But yeah, we're gonna be doing some more Xenoverse like really late tonight, just because I'm working on getting other characters up to their evolution states. Or not their evolution, yeah. I guess their evolution states, I could call them that. The transformation levels. Which apparently it ties into your level, not just how much of the story you've gotten completed. But yeah. Having the 40 ton weights is a big help for leveling characters. <laughs> Pikachu, Thunderbolt. Mr. Mine is down. Pidgeotto. I do like what they do with Sabrina in this game. It acts like when you come up to the gym as Ash, where she just has an Abra in you. And then it evolves, essentially, into the Kadabra, and then... Again, into an Alakazam. Thunderbolt. Uh, Pokemon. I preferred Pokemon over Digimon. Digimon is fun. I just... I couldn't get into it as much as I did with Pokemon because the games they came out with Digimon were very convoluted. Where Pokemon is simple. Or, like, the Digimon made the digital readers instead of just a, uh... Did I go this way? Yeah. I'm going this way now. There's another one. Yeah, Digimon did, like, digital readers and stuff like that, which weren't actually games. They were kind of cheap, not... or cheapy, kind of cruddy toys. A.S. Haunter. I should have a good group for Overwatch tonight, which will be fun. I've been trying to get back into the groove of having four, five, maybe even six people online. No, Nightshade, no. I'm going to be disappointed if they do drop a bunch of Doomfist and seasonal stuff tomorrow, because I have to work tomorrow, so I won't be able to play any of it for stream. Or at all, really. Come on. There we go. Let's keep on teleporting. And, yeah. It's this one. No? How about this one? You eventually make it. And quite literally, you just can walk vertically like this, and you'll eventually get to Sabrina. Which I learned that way back when. Alright, Sabrina, let's go. Let's see how my Pikachu can handle your... <coughs> can handle your Abra evolution lines. First learn to bend spoons with my mind. Show your powers. Ugh. But, uh, what is it? Pokemon Adventure? The manga version of Pokemon, right? Like, the old one? I'm, I'm really loving that right now, because it's really good. Oh, wait, yeah. 
this. This is what I need. Eh, that's close enough. Yeah. Well, in the original Digimon, they still kind of had the same standard, hey, this is what's going on. And with Pokemon, it wasn't really filler, it was them explaining, hey, they're going to each and every little bit of this, that, and the other. Like, this is how an adventure should work. That's why I don't mind One Piece filler all that much. Like, it's there because it's meant to be there, and it actually fits into the scenario. Kinesis. Accuracy fell. You're... you're gonna... you're gonna regret that. You're definitely going to regret making my accuracy go down. Or maybe not. Seems like Pikachu's a little weak, huh? Uh, quick attack. Let's see how this does with Pidgeotto. It's decent, so... As long as I can get a couple of hits off with quick attack with Pidgeotto, I should be fine-ish. Especially if that's the only amount of damage you're going to do. Come on. You bastard. That's like half health, yeah. Heals, recovery heals for half health. That's not bad. There we go. Quick attack again. Pidgeotto, you can do this. Ah, Kinesis failed. And you're you were gonna try and recover, weren't you? Pidgeot level 34. Nice. 127 Ivysaur. Everyone's getting some experience here. Tini leveled up. Level 13. <laughs> okay, now here is the the uphill battle. Uh, yeah. Okay, take down. Let's see how much more... See, I'm gonna... Uh, okay, so you reduce damage done to you. But it reduces the damage done to me, so... Come on. Take down. Damn you. I'm gonna keep trying this until it works, hopefully. <laughs> also, sorry I uh, kinda got into streaming late today. I got home from streaming and was just... Or not streaming. From D&D &D and was hungry as a motherfucker. Yeah, was hungry. Gotta be careful about my language. I was hungry when I got home. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I need a good, solid, just one shot in there that helps out, but... Alright. Ivysaur. This is the last one, so I'm at least gonna Toxic first. This might make me win. Goes heavy poison with a leech seed. Yeah, you might be able to recover, but you're not going to be able to recover that much, that quickly. I I know. I just I don't like swearing's usually okay in most instances. It's fine, but I also don't want to be reliant on some of the just words. For Kurt. Like, I don't want to be reliant on cussing to make my content entertaining. But at the same time, it's just kind of part of me. There we go. Ivysaur is really good with that combo, because the Toxic every turn does more and more damage. And this is going to be interesting, because my Poliwag's probably going to get a level up from that poison. Hit, oh wait, no, not Hypnosis. Psywave. Uh, there we go. Poison again. Yep, heavy poison, and... <clears throat> heavy poison and healed. I'm going to give that to my Ivysaur, even though it fainted. Poliwag leveled up to 24... Gatini. There we go. 
Yeah, my Ivysaur definitely 